New tonight, a vacant corner in one of Sacramento's most disadvantaged neighborhoods could soon be getting a major makeover. Tonight, we're getting answers on how it could become a new place for local entertainment and people wanting to open up micro businesses. There's grand plans for this plaza. And it's amazing how much we're able to get in here. Dwayne Crenshaw with the Greater Sacramento Urban League is working to turn this vacant piece of land into a cultural hub for the Del Paso Heights community. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to make this corner pop. He says the location at the corner of Marysville and Grand Avenue has for years been a magnet for crime. We want to reclaim the corner for the community. The new project is called Grand Gathering and will feature an outdoor stage along with spots for local food trucks and other small business vendors. The key is we are going to have professional business technical assistance providers who will help folks grow a business. We need it. We need it badly. Many who live and work in the neighborhood are excited about the transformation. This is an excellent idea and I can't wait to see it built out. Long term plans also call for renovating the building next door into a commercial kitchen and maker space for people with entrepreneurial ideas. Maybe they have this secret cookie recipe that they need to try to test out and package and there'll be 3D printers and embroidery machines and computers and you name it all the technology that an innovator may need to get their business off the ground. And supporters hope it will provide jobs and educational opportunities for students at Grant High School, which is just a block away. This space that is desperately needed doesn't exist and is long overdue. Well, the property was purchased with a $2 million donation from philanthropist Mackenzie Scott, the former wife of Amazon founder Jeff Bezos. The Urban League is hoping to open the site by next summer.